All right. Fish and liquor in the house. All right. So what we've done here is just put some celery, some water, and some baby carrots in the crock pot. And that's been cooking for a while. First video is just loaded, so I'm going to make the second one. We're just over here listening to our new PA system. I finally got it in stereo today. Woo, baby. That's nice. Anyway, we're going to take this a little bit slow. We've got a bag of goodies down here, some stuff in the fridge. So we're going to have us some stewed tomatoes. I like the Mexican. They, they got the, the Italian ones, you know, too. So these are the best choice. Pretty good, cheap, you know. We got some little uh, cheap mushrooms. You know, we're not going to use all this. But uh, this is one of the secret ingredients of this dish. Just some tomato, simple tomato paste. I got some with some bagel and garlic and oregano, they says in here. So, you know, I'll have to dig in there and see if they really put some good shit in there. Anyway, going back over here to the fridge. I got some ingredients. Now, I use more ingredients in that old red buck red. Buck friend, buck feeder, you know, all that. So I got some stuff here, you know. So this stuff is over there. This is over here. Hold on. I didn't put it. All right. I got this and this. Okay. So here's a green pepper. Very expensive. I like to use other peppers, but they didn't have any there. So another secret ingredient. Buck Red Buck says put juice of one lemon in. This is a huge pot. I should have two lemons, but oh well. I got some squash. Buck Red Buck, boom, put that in there. But this is a dish. Uh, I got some zucchini too, so you know. And I like to use vegetable stuff, but I couldn't get any, so I had to do this chicken broth. Um, you know, so you know, it all tastes good. So what we're going to do. It's, uh, I got some onions over here, some Vidalia onions growing here on the corner of the counter. And uh, so what I'm going to do, this video number two, I'm going to keep it short. So you know how to chop shit up. I don't have to do that for you on camera. You know, I show you the ingredients, I spelled it out for you. You know, if you can't make this dish. Now let me check and make sure I don't forget anything. Hold on. All right. Okay, and I like to make a little, no, no, that's not, that's a different thing to do, but anyway, the most important thing about this dish is you don't want to put your fish in, you don't want to put that, I'll show you how to do that later, don't worry about that, just get all your vegetables in there, let you, uh, let your celery and your, and your carrots cook first. Cook them for about an hour or two. You know, don't pulverize them, but you know, get them cooked. They're not even boiling yet. They've been over here for at least an hour and a half. But it's a crock pot, you know. And I don't. I think it's from China, and the, and the low setting is high. I think the high setting is low. So I'm gonna put it back on low and see if it'll boil now. Cause it's been sitting for an hour and a half, ain't boiling yet. That's what you get when you get shit from the dollar store. You know, on sale. It's fucked up. Well, anyway, said a Jerry hadn't had a drink yet, but I got a beer going, so I'm a little tired. Set up late last night, got up late this afternoon, and uh, got some, a lot of shit done. Judd, I got your little boat motor off the ground over here. I had to, I had to cut the wood off of that one because the things were stuck to get that engine off of that. But I put, put a new piece of wood in there, got the little engine off the ground in my house, nice there. So I, I knew you was worried about that, and I knew you called me about the, uh, this truck tomorrow that I gotta go get. So anyway, uh, Sailor so Jerry signing out. And, uh, you know, trying to do a few things here. That's all. And, uh, you know, so that's video number two there. So, peace out.